two decades, Harlingen Police and the National Guard have worked to make your neighborhood safer with an initiative called Operation Crackdown. News Center 23's Mike Jimenez reports. Well, good evening, everyone. I am here in Harlingen for Operation Crackdown, where the Harlingen police, along with the help of the National Guard, are currently tearing down a home they say was a nuisance in the community. We saw a lot of prostitution, a lot of drug dealing. Um, even the mailman said they offered both to him, so it was so bad. With chance of knock it down, this home in the 500 block of West Monroe in Harlingen was torn down by the National Guard. This was one of 23 homes that was torn down during Operation Crackdown, a program that identifies abandoned or neglected structures. Authorities say these types of homes attract drug users and are a haven for criminal activity. Allegations of drug use, prostitution, uh, gang violence, uh, family violence, it, it runs the gambit. Chief Attic says over the past three years, officers have had to respond to 277 calls for disturbances at the property. Chief says that's time taken away from officers focusing on fighting crime in other areas of the city. And those calls also disrupt the quality of life of the community. We're stronger with our community working side by side with us and not in spite of them. When the neighbors call in and say we've got a problem, our responsibility as a city uh, and as a neighborhood Right, and community policing is we help identify those problems if we can solve them. And resident Narcy Martinez says she is thankful for the police and National Guard for taking action and making her neighborhood a safer place. The children can come out and play, the older people can come and walk, and it feels a lot better that there won't be all that crime there. And the Harlingen police chief tells me if residents should see a home that is causing a nuisance in their community, to call police. Reporting here in Harlingen, I'm Mike Jimenez for KBO News Center 23. And the chief of police says this not only cleans up crime, but creates a bit of a fresh start for anyone looking to rebuild on that property.